welcome back to my channel. Today we are getting ready and we're also investing at the same time. And by that I mean we're going on our first family holiday. I'm so excited, tiny bit stressed just because it's like the great unknown. I need to start getting on top of myself. Funny thing happens when planning this holiday when you've got a wee baby, a new addition. I have been so focused on getting her ready and her organised that I almost completely forgot about myself. I realised that I had everything sitting out and then I was like, oh god, I don't have anything. <laughs> I have nothing. So, I'm going to kind of do my beauty routine today. I'm going to be doing a bit of a kind of like detox hair mask, face mask, just kind of starting to get myself right because long gone are the days where I can like have a day dedicated to that. So I'm going to like do it over the course of the next few days. You might notice it's eerily quiet. I have the afternoon to myself. Jack's taking the baby to his mum and dad's. I sometimes go but today I was like no I'm gonna just stay home, sort myself out and start packing her stuff. So we're gonna start off with a bath and a shower to wash my hair. My hair needs washed so bad. I had oil in it then I slipped my hair into a ponytail. Life happened and I ended up sleeping in it and I feel so gross. So we're gonna do a whole reset there. I've got stuff to style my hair as well. So that'll hopefully last me until the day before we leave and then I can do the exact same routine again. I have some makeup bits as well that I'm gonna try out and I'm gonna do like a little face of makeup today as well. I'm delighted to say that this next portion of the video is sponsored by Cult Beauty. I love Cult Beauty. I've got the best partnership with them. I've been working with them all year. So all the products I use, all the beauty products, you will be able to find on Cult Beauty and you can use my discount JamieCB for up to 20% off. Great for a haul, so good if you're needing this kind of reset. The vibe of what I'm doing today, I ideally would do like once a week anyway. We're gonna get started, I'm gonna really enjoy my bath. I'm gonna read a little bit of my book in my bath as well. And it's just gonna be a gorgeous time. I've got a candle burning downstairs. Like I said, the house is peaceful. I say that like Roma's crazy, she's not even crazy, she's the happiest wee baby. We had the best cuddles today. She's getting very grabby with my face. Oh, I've gotten hooked like this. Anyway, let's go. I'm going to show you guys what I'm up to and then we'll talk about the products after. Oh my god, I'm so ready for this. hair that looks really good I think it's a wee bit curlier than I like but it goes down really quick but that looks healthy and shiny oh my gosh and I always find my fringe a bit curly at the start and um, ignore this cut in my head I was outside in the garden me Jack and Romy and I thought it would be all outdoors and fun and try swing from a branch it snapped and I fell and then the branch hit me in the head the evidence is still lying in the front garden so that's good I have a couple of makeup bits to try but I'll go over what I used when I was doing like my pamper in the bath. You are sitting on top of a couple of the products, let me pick you up. The Way Detox Shampoo, it's great. See if you're like me and you like to stretch out your hair washes and use hairspray and oil your scalp and, and all that kind of stuff, you can get quite a lot of build up. I do do scalp treatments but this is an amazing shampoo. It's really, really brilliant. It was in everything bath. If you feel me. So I scrubbed my body from head to toe. This is the Way Scalp and Body Scrub. I love it. They've got a few different scents now. Works really well, washes off nice and it dissolves in the bath, which I really like. Hero for me is this hair mask. It's the Coco and Eve Youth Revive. The reason that I was excited to try it is because it's a hair and scalp mask. So you saw me put it all through my scalp, my hair, and then I left it in a clip while I did the rest of my stuff. And then I washed it out in the shower. So I kind of did everything in the bath and then finished off in the shower. I think that it's amazing. I'm going to take this on holiday with me for sure. It smells incredible. And then I used the Sam McKnight 
save the do. This is the heat protection style starter. First time trying this. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I do forget ye old heat protector, but I do, I do think it makes a massive difference. Obviously I'm protecting your hair so it makes a difference in the long run, but also my hair styled really easily today. Really smooth and it looks really shiny and healthy. So I'll take this on holiday as well. And then I used the Sam McKnight hairspray. This is the modern hairspray. Oh my God, it's amazing. It's so good. And you can actually use this before you style your hair. So not only is it a really, really flexible hairspray that doesn't build up, it is also a heat protectant. So you can use this before or after or both when you style your hair, but I love this stuff. Highly recommend. I've prepped all my skin and there's a foundation that I really wanted to try. Danessa Myricks is another makeup artist brand. She seems, I've never met her, but she seems like the loveliest person. She's so great, especially her Instagram. But this is the Yummy Skin Serum Foundation. So I'm gonna try it out today just to see how the color is. You twist it off. I'm wearing the shade N6 and I just colour matched myself online and it actually looks great. I'm going to take a little bit. I don't actually know how much I need so I might have gone a wee bit too heavy. But let's just try. Ooh, wow! I mean that, <laughs> that match is pretty amazing. It's got a slight scent to it but it's ingredients. It's not like scented, if you know what I mean? It just kind of smells, not in a bad way, but like paint. <laughs> some some products do just have like a kind of natural scent to them, but that is absolutely beautiful. Oh, covering up my little scratched head. Wow. Yeah, that's great. I do have a little bit of face tan on at the moment, so this actually might work great on a holiday. And then what I like to do, if I'm going somewhere and I know I'm gonna get a bit of a tan, I will take products so I can customize the shade of foundation. So I'll just use bronzer and maybe like a deeper concealer just to slightly deepen it up. But as far as coverage goes, it's really good coverage. It's more than I thought it would be. Like I've got, what a waste, that's such a shame. I've got way more in the back of my hand left over. That is beautiful. The component's really cool as well. I'm definitely gonna take that with me. I'm so excited. And the other product I've got is actually lips. So I'm gonna go and do the rest of my face and I'll be right back and we can, well, I'm gonna try it on. I, I love it already, but I'll show you. I've set that foundation and it looks amazing. Uh, very glowy, I'm not sure. See if you've got really oily skin or you prefer a matte finish. Like really matte, it might not be for you, but um, I think it's stunning. I'm just doing my mascara and listen, see when you're doing mascara, don't look ahead and do it. Look down into a little compact mirror or something because you can just get right in and right to the ends without it stamping on your lid. And every time I do this, my mascara just turns out amazing. The last bit I've got from Cult Beauty. Um, and I say that th there's so much on there. I've literally got so many products on my desk that are all from Cult Beauty that I'm gonna be taking on holiday with me but are just like every day. So this is the, la the last thing for now. And it's a NARS lipstick. I tried these for the first time in New York and I was nine weeks pregnant, hadn't told anyone. So sick. I was so ill. Um, you might remember that vlog, but this is the NARS Power Matte Lipstick in the shade Dragon Girl. It is a really gorgeous red, and these are so long wearing. They're that formula that dry down almost like a, oh my God, look how tiny my lips look without lip liner. They dry down like a liquid lipstick. And then before it dries, I'm gonna line my lips quickly. I'm gonna use a nude. And I love what a brown lip liner does to a red. I think it makes it much more wearable, honestly. I feel like it turns it almost into a nude. If you guys ever wonder who Drogba is, he does not hang out with me. <laughs> he is his own man. Do you know the girl's girl? Okay, just to help blend that in, I'm gonna go back over with the NARS. I remember them talking about this formula though. It took a really long time for them to get right. I think they were working on it for years. Now I feel like when I'm wearing a red lip, I can like go in and then add more once it's on because I can see that I definitely need some more kind of shape in my face, I think. I quite like my eyes this bare, but I think I'm gonna go in and do some like freckles and a wee bit more powder, do you see what I mean? Here, but I'm gonna go in with a bit more bronzer and just go over my natural freckles, I think, and I'll be right back. <laughs> Tell you what I did. I added loads more bronzer right on my cheeks and I darkened my eyebrows. Might not be for everyone, but I like it. I think because my hair is so dark, like see if I was to take that blonde away, they kind of match. Oh my God, no, actually they're quite dark. Maybe they're too dark. Anyway, that is my transformation. I think it's pretty good. Quite often before, 
I would go on holiday, I would go and see Jack Baxter to get my hair done, but I feel like I'm managing quite well myself with all my treatments and stuff, keeping on top of it. And I'm gonna save my appointment for after my holidays because sun, if I was to get like color and stuff done, sun doesn't really do great things for it, does it? But that is honestly it as far as holiday prep goes. I think I used to do a lot more, but times have changed. But do you know what I really like about my routine now? You can so do this weekly if you like. Like it, you don't need to be going on holiday, you don't need to be doing anything, but see that complete reset, that everything bath, the hair treatments and then styling it. Like I, if I did this once a week, I'd be feeling excellent. And then I love to try out a few new bits of makeup that I can take on my, my holidays. Ah, I need to shower it. Oh God, the, the clock's ticking. I'm waiting for you to stop wobbling. Hello, I have, <laughs> I do do, I do do. Oh no, I'm not ready. Ah, wrong one. I'm not gonna lie, no. I keep on saying that like I lie every other time I speak. I'm not quite sure what to do.